Pat, a difficult task for the sponsors today to pick a man of the match. They opted for Liam Craig, but you could have picked anyone out there in the green and white shirt. Yeah, there was some good performance. I think everybody, like you say, it was from uh, Ben right through the team, was, was very, very good today. Defensively, very solid and obviously created a lot of chances as well going forward. So, very pleasing. You must be delighted again. James Collins, Paul Heffernan, both on the score sheet again. We said that last week about strikers. Maybe all it needed was just to get James Collins to get off the mark and now all of a sudden he'll go on a spree. Yeah, you're hoping that, you know, he scored last week, scored this week, so he gets on a bit of a run. But, you know, I thought their overall play was very, very good today. Uh, I think one of them was in the force, however, James spins and has a great strike, just nearly would. Would have been a fantastic goal. But their movement and their, and their, their, their link-up play was very good today. We were just saying about that shot. Check the paintwork on that joint between the post and the crossbar. It just missed it by a fraction. But the goals today, very well worked goals. Team goals. You know, we, we've been used in the past to Lee Griffiths creating goals out of nothing for himself. But today, the goals we scored were both well worked team goals. They were, and the uh, good finishes, and also. You know, we probably created maybe another three, four decent chances, uh, a couple in the first half, and then there was a spell midway through the second half where we had two or three real good chances where we pressed and won the ball high back off St Mirren and created a couple of chances. You know, so if you if you're looking for something that that was, I suppose a down today, we probably could have scored a couple of more goals. That was exactly what we said in the commentary. If there was one disappointment, it wasn't. It was maybe that we didn't score three or four. But that said, all round. The midfield, I thought, were absolutely outstanding. Kevin Thompson just links things up. He keeps the ball moving. Scott Robertson, Tom Table, just absolute. Liam Craig, all absolute dynamos in there today. Yeah, I think there, there's there's a good blend in there at the moment, and I think um, particularly Tom was probably getting fitter and fitter the more games he's played. Um, Liam is, you know, a very very good player and has that position and, and plays it really well. I think Robbo as well is one that's getting more fitter and, and coming onto a game. So, you know, and Tom Tay was just. Tom is just, you know, he's he's a workhorse. You know, he just, I think that last run before we took him off killed him. He just ran out of oxygen at that stage, so it was time to change him. But, you know, they're all good players, but I think the key to that as well, they've got, they know they've got one or two others that are not playing at the moment that keeps everybody on the toes. And at the back as well, Michael Nelson and Paul Hanlon seem to have stuck up, uh, struck up a good partnership. And your two lads at full back there, particularly again, Alan Mabry, he didn't have much of a pre season at all. We spoke to Tim Clancy just before the game. I think he's worried about getting back in the side. Yeah, well, you're hoping everybody's in that position where you're in the team, you have the jersey, and you want to stay in it. Alan is uh, one we just seem to have wretched look at right back at the moment. Uh, obviously, Tim has been out a while. Young Fraser's probably just not. We probably had to press him into playing him before he should have, really, and, and needs a bit more work and fitness levels and probably more game time. And Alan has, has been pressed into that position, and we've played Louis there, which probably unbalances us a little bit at times. But you know, sometimes if you, you, you don't have anything else, but I think Maves in the last two games has been different class. I think the back four have been very, very solid in general.